We are back in the kitchen with Chris Jenner, making recipes out of our new book, In the Kitchen. With Chris, we made that great fusilli, and now we get to have dessert. Dessert! I know. This is actually one of the first desserts that I learned how to make that was harder than like jello. <laughs> when I was really, really young, and I decided to do something that I found in a cookbook. I love to collect cookbooks. And I saw this, a picture of this lemon chiffon pie, and I thought, that looks so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I was married to Robert Kardashian at the time, and he loved anything with lemon in it. So I thought, okay, I'll try it. And it seemed sort of daunting to me, but I did step by step, and I followed this recipe, and I switched it up a little bit, and then I made it my own and added, mm -hmm. and, like I played with it for a long time. And I realized that this was going to be so delicious you know, after I got finished with it. And I like it because it's fresh graham cracker crust, mm. which, you know, I, I love to make myself. And it, I like the way it looks kind of rustic mm -hmm. when you put it together yeah. in a pie. Yeah. And I always make two oh. when I make this. That's because, a good plan. You know, someone always comes along and either eats it or, you know, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> how dare they? So I do the, the fresh graham cracker crust and then all the ingredients inside are super fresh. So fresh lemons and all the all the stuff, fresh whipped cream that I do myself oh, and a little mint on the good. top. But it, so fluffy and yummy and lemony. It's just like a big burst of flavor in your mouth. I so almost don't want to eat it because it's know, so pretty. It, looks really pretty. it is pretty, right? But I, I don't know. But I'll get over and that. I love anything with a graham cracker crust. <laughs> is right. there a, fa so, a favorite dessert in your family too that you the always brownies. Have to make? The brownies. The brownies. Yeah. They, I make them and they just disappear. It's like they're little ghosts. They just oh whoop, they're See, gone. You've had so much success in so many different Thank facets you. of your life. Is there anything? Anything that you would think that you haven't done before that you think that is something I would one day like to do? Mm. Uh, you know what? I feel so satisfied. And I just feel lucky and blessed to wake up every day and get to work with my family and do what I really love to do mm -hmm. and just feel loved and give love. And, you know, we have so much fun. And you, I lay my head down on the pillow every night and I feel really satisfied. So nice. I think that, you know, if, when things come, I'm up for anything. Right. Like, I love a great adventure. Mm -hmm. I love to travel. We all go places as a family. Every year we try to go someplace we've never been before. Saw the Bora Bora episode. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which yeah, is beautiful. In Thailand. In Thailand. This last year. So, uh, you know, and we haven't decided where we're going this year, so I'm excited to pick a place That's and awesome. have a new adventure. But, you know, this is part of it. You, you travel the world and you find new recipes, and I love to collect cookbooks. Mm -hmm. And we were at, in the south of France this last summer, at the Hotel du Cap, and I, they have a cookbook. So I got that cook, you know, it's like everywhere I go, I try to get a great cookbook. I am sold Influence. on the lemon chiffon. It is it so great. Well, thank good. you so much. Make sure mm. you thank pick you. up your copy of In the Kitchen with Chris on Amazon and in stores now. Thank you so much, everybody, for being with us today. And don't forget to make someone's life better. better. Mm. More, yeah, more lemon, more lemon. <laughs> yeah, more lemon. <laughs>